Last time, after I left off, um, I started just building a house, and, well, I don't like what I have so far. I think, I think I'm just gonna use creative and build a house. I have, like, 90% of the materials that I want, so I'm just gonna build, like, a decent chunk of my house, and hopefully it looks good. That is the only time I'm going to use creative, is when building, like, a big project like this, and I will make sure to have all of the materials that I'm using for it, though. So, yeah, let's get started. First, I'm going to tear all this down. Okay. Ancient oak log. I'm also going to get rid of like all of the um all of the materials I use on the house after this too. Where's the search?
Okay. And with that, my house is done for now. Um, like I said, I'm really trying to not cheat. I had, like, all of these materials, except for the spruce wood on this door, but I wasted materials on that by accident, so I gave myself a small freebie. Um, anyways. Now, let's see that. I think I used more oak dark oak logs than I had so I'm just gonna get rid of all of the dark oak I have that's strange I thought I had oh, okay I have it on me I just had an idea I thought I had more birch Oh, well. Oh, oh, I do. Okay. I used more birch and dark oak than I had, so I'll get rid of all of those. But first, how does this look? No. Okay. Alright, I got rid of all of the materials I used on this. Didn't mean to do that. Actually, I do mean to do that. Hold on. Cobblestone. Where's the mossy cobblestone? There we go. Okay. Now I'm done building my house for now. Um, I don't think I have any mossy cobblestone anymore. Yeah, I, I'll get rid of these. Just to be fair. Even though they're not the mossy cobblestone. Okay. And with that, I am done with creative. I'll say it again, I will only use creative in the series as something like this comes up and I have like all of the materials for. I mean, I'm not even putting a, a roof on it yet because I don't have the materials for it. But once I get the roof materials, I will be going back into creative. Okay. Oh, um, okay. Okay, I'm back in survival. Feels weird to not fly around right now. Don't attack me. Okay, cool, it's light enough for you. So last time, after I got off, I just explored a tiny bit around my area and I added a few markers, POI for point of interest, and um, yeah, there's some interesting things over there I didn't explore at all, 
like I didn't explore the things that were interesting to me. I wanted to be on camera for that. And that, that might be what we do next. After we, after we sleep. It would be nice to find some sheep to shear the... So I'm going to make a set of shears right now. What is this? Arts? I don't- I have no idea what arts are. How come you're not attacking me? Counts as a monster. It would be, it would have been cool if doing that set my spawn there, but that's okay. Cool, my bed traveled with it. Let's check out this pillager tower really quick. I might die doing this, actually. But we have a spawn point set in- Oh, speaking of wool. Anyways, we have a spawn point set in the village, so it should be okay. Iron golem. Cool. Looks like after this we'll have an iron golem. This is a really cool pillager tower. It has like all this moss growing around it. Oh. You appear to have nowhere. What is this? Hazelnut. Cool. He dropped crude fragments. Oh, more wool. That's nice. Is this just a, is this just a cave? Oh, uh, no. Okay. Oh, iron. Yes, I, I see. I need to get rid of those doors. Okay, that's the entrance. I did not see that. This is like a crumbling pillager tower. It's, that's pretty cool. Is there any smithing template scroll of lightning resistance more smithing templates birch black seeds of oh, carrots yes oh bottle of enchanting okay nothing too great up here And I know that if you, um, where is it? Okay, so that banner, if you take that down, uh, the pillagers will stop spawning if you take those banners down. But I actually don't mind the pillagers because they give you, when you kill a pillager that has a banner floating above him, it gives you, um, like exile or whatever it's called. A, um, a debuff where if you step into a village it will start a raid and you can get some very good items from raids so I'm going to keep that because okay I'm just going to cut this all of this wool down and take these pumpkins here no Um, I guess this is for, like, a multiplayer?
Okay, where is my death? Okay, there's the particles I was looking for. I'm a ghost. I know I can float, but why can't I just fly? Oh, let's see how it looks. Not too bad from far away. I will change that color scheme as I get better blocks though. Man, that creeper, I didn't even see it. It came out of nowhere. What? Oh, okay. Um, this is a scary pillager. It looks like I'm drowning or something. I I got enough wool. Okay, that was weird. Okay, according to the map, my house is right here. Cool. I was lost for a second, just scrambling to get away from him. Home a bright green. Okay. Well, I'm going to end the episode off here. We didn't do too much. We just built a house and explored the pillager tower, and well, that was a uh, not too much was done. See you all next time. <laughs>